Donna and Kyra. <laughs> Today I have an unclaimed baggage box. So what is unclaimed baggage, right? So this is the second order that I have done for unclaimed baggage. The first one I selected um, was for reselling purposes. This one is maybe for my own purpose. <laughs> and um, me. And maybe Kyla. So unclaimed baggage is really cool. So if you go fly somewhere and somehow your luggage gets lost, what happens to your luggage? Apparently it ends up here. <laughs> so this is a location in Scottsboro, Alabama, um, which after I did my last video, I found out my aunt has actually been to the actually unclaimed baggage location. You can go in there and shop as well, which I didn't know. If you've been there before, I would love to hear about it in the comments below. But if you're a reseller or you're just looking for a really good deal, I will leave the link below in the website so that you can shop. You can get super discounted brand named items for a fraction of the price. I'm actually personally shopping on there now because they have really cool stuff. Um, but a lot of brand new things too with tags, which is crazy. I'd be so upset if I lost my luggage and had brand new claim tags in it. Anyway, so what did I decide to get? So they have these mystery boxes as well where they group items together and then they sell them at a wholesale price. Usually the bundles are only about 10 or $15, which is what each of these were. I ended up getting three different ones and let me see what I got. Let me get my little invoice out so I can remember. So one of them is a winter blouse mystery bag. And that one you could actually select the sizes. So I ended up selecting my size. So I'm going to try the items on so that I can see whether or not I'm going to keep them for myself. And me. Yeah. So the other okay, item. Tiny ones. Yeah. So for Kyla, I ended up getting her a girl's pajama mystery box. <laughs> but the only sizes they came in are 12 month and 4T. And Kyla is just now getting out of the 4T, so they may not fit her. But for $10 or $15, I figured, why not? And there's actually six per bag. Um, the blouses, there's five. And then this one's a weird one, but I thought I would give it a try, is the women's sock mystery bag. There's five in there, and they're supposed to be like new or new condition socks. Mom, so I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. Mom, I will, I will open my jammers. I know. We'll see. She needs some pajamas, so I'm hoping they fit no, her. No, will it? Pajamas. And pajamas are supposed to be kind of tight anyway. So we'll see. We'll see how they look. Anyway, they are mystery, so we have no clue what we got. We just know the categories that we ordered, and it was nice that you could actually select the size. The last one that I got, I ended up getting spring dresses. I also got um, sunglass cases. And when you buy multiple ones, they'll combine the shipping, which is another reason that I wanted to do all three of them. And the, they change all the time um, because it's whatever they have available. And then kids, too. So if you don't see what you like, you can also go in there. You can go check in there period periodically so that oh, you can kind of see if they have anything that you're interested in. So they do a really nice job of wrapping the items as well. So <laughs> last time I got this, I was really surprised to see that, but it's really cute. And they have this really cute little sticker on top too. Yeah. All right. Discover lost treasures. Yeah. And we'll save the paper for, oh, they give you an extra one. Ah, look at that, Kyla. And bubble wrap. I don't know what in here needs bubble wrap, but that's okay. All right, which one do we want to do first? You want to do yours, Kyla, first? Because uh -huh. you're so curious. All right, here's Kyla's bag. Let's take a look at what's in here. So they're all I brand new with tags, them. I think. I really want to put them out. Okay, here. What's on that one? <laughs> Lambs. Little sheep. Lambs, yeah, look at that. That's I got them lambs. All right, hopefully there's tops, but they're probably mixed to pieces, I'm thinking. There's one Ooh. with elephants. Oh, look at these, Kyla. This is cute. This has teapots and little, like, teacups on it. And then here is a cute snail top. Oh, look how cute that is. <laughs> look, here's, here's cows. <laughs> I don't know. They might fit you. They look like they would fit you. And this one's a long sleeve one for the winter time. That one might be a little too small for you. But those are all new with tags, so that's great. They don't match, <laughs> but who cares when you're wearing pajamas? All right, the next one in here are my socks. So I'm kind of curious. I'm already seeing some interesting looking socks here on the top. All right, let's see it's here. doggy ones. <laughs> doggy ones. Making moments socks. I, this is almost like the ones where you take a picture of your own dog and you get the socks made. Have you guys seen those before? For every pair that purchased, you help a local animal shelter. So I don't know if that's what this is. If it's a personalized dog, I'm wearing somebody else's dog on my feet. No. <laughs> don't know about those. All right, what else do we have here, Kyla? 
All right, these are like Christmas socks. Those are funny. I don't know what brand that is, though. CC? I don't want to mix them up. I don't, know. I don't want to mix them up. Um, so it looks like all of these are new. Um, these are just fashion boutique winter socks. This looks like a similar pair. Yep, same brand, fashion boutique winter socks. I like that color, though. And then these are just a uh, new name kind of pair of socks. Those we might ditch. I don't know. So that's interesting. That wasn't exactly what I had expected. I guess I was expecting like some Bombas or some Victoria's Secret socks or Nike socks. Well, that would have been nice. Right but there. at least they're new. All right. So here them. are my blouses that I ordered. So let's see what they sent me, Kyla. So let's see here. Here is the first one. This is by PST by Project Social T. Never heard of that before. But there is a cute little striped and then it has like a tie going on there. That's not normally my style, but I certainly will try it on. It might be kind of cropped though, so I'm not quite sure about that. All right, what else do we have here? Fashion Nova, brand new with tags. Purple blouse that ties in the middle. Okay, I don't know about that one either, Kyla. What do you think about that try one? them on? I don't know. Okay, I do see, like this, this is an ASOS, brand new with tags. Top, look at that. That's cute. It's actually, um, it's going to be hard to see in the camera, but it's a camouflage sheer pattern to that. Like, how cool is that? But it's it is see-through, but that's different. I can definitely see myself wearing that. And ASOS is a great brand, so I'm really surprised, actually, to see that. There's All one right. more. And then, is this a, oh, two more, actually. This one is by Good Time USA. Never heard of that before. Whoa, what's going on with that? It's like a long sleeve tie-dye crop top? Get it for my sister. <laughs> I don't know, it probably might, might be too big for a sissy. All right, and then this one is Anthony Richards. Long sleeve burgundy top. I mean, it's a nice basic top. Stop. So should I try some of these on? What do you uh -huh. think? All right, why not? Let's try some of them on. Mine. All right, so let's talk about the cute one first. All right, okay. step back so I can see you. All right, what do you got, Kyla? Okay, I have two black pants you can see right here and a top. Because it's so fitty. Does it fit? Yes, it does. Yay! And I really need new pajamas. And these are so cute. I think I'm going to keep these. Yeah, you're definitely going to keep them because we already paid for them. <laughs> Let's talk about my top. You want to move over for a second, Kyla? Crazy. We don't spend a lot of time on this. So look how super long this is. I don't even know like what size this is. Apparently, they didn't know either. And it's just super big. <laughs> fun to try on so I thought I'd go ahead and try it on for you guys. All right, unfortunately the ASOS top was too small, just too tight. I mean it fit but it was just too tight but I'm gonna sell that one because it's brand new with tags. And then the burgundy shirt was again just kind of like a weird style but let me see if I can try one of the other tops on. Hold on. Okay, so this is the next top I put on. So these are um, elephant pants with bows and flowers on the um, elephants and these are smells that I decided to go ahead and put on, which is this purple sheer tie top. Honestly, the longer I wear it, the, I don't know, the more I like it. It's kind of cute. Got this long tail in the back and like this tie in the front. It's like casual business. It does have like the buttons on the sleeve. I don't know, what do you guys think? It's like a new style for me. Huh, I don't know, would you rock this or not? <laughs> I got one more top and then Kyla's got one more set of pajamas. Hang on. Okay, so this is the last top. I paired on is a cow top left, brown, I mean, sheeps. It's pretty appropriate, right? Yeah, it's pretty appropriate, right? Like you're at a farm? Yeah, like, <laughs> I have a feeling Kyle will be wearing that one tonight for a bed. What do you think? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So then this is my last top. Again, kind of surprising. I would never have picked this out. It is cropped, so you can see the tank underneath. Um, I would never wear it without something underneath of it, but I don't know, it's kind of cute. What do you guys think? It's definitely outside my comfort zone. 
cute little tie on the side. I think it's kind of form fitting and flattering the shape of it. Um, I don't know, <laughs> what do you guys think with a pair of jeans or maybe a light colored jeans, dark colored jeans, I'm not quite sure because this is completely different. So that's really all I've got for you guys today. But I just wanted to share with you guys some of the options of what you can get. I'll leave the link below for the Unclean Baggaged website so you can go ahead and check it out as well and get yourself a mystery box. If you've already gotten one of these before, I would love to hear what you have bought in the comments below. That's all we've got for you guys today. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and always click that bell so you can see all the new boxes when they come out. Till next time, guys. Bye.